hello everyone in this video guys I'm going to show how to install the virtual box and Windows 10 in it so first of all we need to have the virtual box as well as the Windows 10 ISO file okay so simply open the Google Chrome here and on the search bar you need to type here virtual box download go to the first official link once you go to the first official link just hit the option windows host and once you click on that it will be starting downloaded so once it is downloaded guys you just need to double click on it to run and also in order to run the windows virtualbox 7.0 we need to install the C++ Visual Studio Visual C++ 2019 just go to official link of Microsoft and once you go there you need to look for Visual 2015-19 and this option and then hit for the 64 bit so once you hit this option as well you have to again run it and both should be run here if this version 7.0 is not working on your windows guys so we have the old version for you as well 6.1 so this should work in most of the windows just hit the option same and install it so once you have installed the virtual box inside your system you should be able to see the virtual box like this okay the second tool we need to have is windows 10 iso file windows 10 iso file hit the download option on the first link okay just click on download tool now and make it bootable and make it iso file okay so i will also give you the link how to download it okay this is a media creation tool we need to just double click on it i will give you a separate video to make a bootable or the iso file of windows 10 or 11 so once you have made the iso file you should be able to see the iso file like this let me show you i have already downloaded that okay you should be able to see the iso file like this so once you have downloaded the iso file as well as the virtual box so you are good to go you need to install it so double click on this software guys once you double click on at that i have created the virtual machine so let me delete it so that i can show you all the details here okay now this is a new tool we need to click on new name your virtual box machine as windows 10 vm now the folder where logs is going to create it so look for your space accordingly so i'm going to give this e drive this is my virtual box drive hit other browse it manually look for the vacant drive okay or you can look for the on your choice and make it this so i have selected the folder where the logs are going to create it and a space is going to take in okay inside the iso image just select that option hit other look for the iso as you can see here the location and hit open okay leave as it is skip this option also if it is tick skip unattended installation untick this next okay we need to skip this option now look for the base memory so whatever memory you have you need to give that according to you i am going to just give it as 1 gb cpu i am going to give it one core just to show you that 
uh, you can give it as per your choice whatever memory as CPU you have hit next now the space I'm going to give it to almost 35 GB hit next now we are done click on finish so you can see the details here base memory is this one boot order is this graphic card details all the details you can get here ok SATA how many GB we are going to give it so once you have all done you just need to hit start and you are good to go windows machine should boot up now also you need to check that the virtualization should be on your on your system ok if I go to performance tab here uh, as you can see let me go to the CPU option then the virtualization should be enabled here if it is not enabled go to the BIOS just enable the virtualization from the BIOS option it's now started guys so the rest of the installation will be same just you need to hit next 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 and you are good to go hit next install it simply setup is starting so let me pause the video for you so it has started let me show you click this option select your operating system here guys ok whatever you want I am going to look for Windows 10 Pro hit next just accept it hit next choose second option and inside here look for the unallocated space just hit next and before that guys if you have any data on it ok for the safer side you can uh, you can transfer the data from here to another free drive hit next we are good to go so let me again pause the video once it is done it will start automatically